Well, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. This is Daniel Abego with the Fluffy Poodle. That's right, Mr. Fluffy Bear and his blue hair. <laughs> um, I'm so faking this smile this morning. You want to know why? It's because today's the day that he goes in for his surgery. That's right, Mr. Fluffy Bear is having surgery today. Yeah. See that yawn? He doesn't want to do it either. Oh, no, I don't want you to. But, hey, he, he has to go in for surgery. He has to go get that tooth fixed. You know, this one right... Is it, nope, that, that side. You see it? That tooth right there. See that brown one? Yeah. He's going to go get that tooth fixed. And uh, they, they have to so put him under for it. And... Uh, I'm, uh, I'll be okay. I'll be all right. Um, anyways, uh, yeah, I know. I know, buddy. I'll be okay. Don't worry about me. Don't worry about me, buddy. I'm worried about you. Yeah. But, uh, like I was saying, um, he has to go and get that tooth fixed. So, um, let's get inside and, uh, Give him some loving. Give him some loving. Let's get him. Let's get him inside. That was rough. I couldn't film. Couldn't film at all. Oh, I couldn't. Oh, I need to cheer up. He's just getting his tooth is extracted. <laughs> Come on, man. Oh, man. Come on, truck. Whew. So, I just dropped Mr. Fluffy Bear off to get his tooth fixed. And that was rough. The good thing is, is they understand. They understand how much he's really helping me. And they understand that. Um, how quick I need him back. So they, they're definitely. They definitely hooked me up and took care of me with number one, great pricing. Number two, they got me in very, very fast. Um, even though we had it scheduled, they got me in extremely, extremely fast. And uh, they said, hey, uh, we're, we're putting them in. We're, we're going to go take them in right now immediately. We're going to go knock this out. Um, he is the first one today, so we'll get them in and get them right back to you. Unfortunately, I have to wait wait for that phone call. It's going to be a couple hours. Excuse me. Is anybody else... Has anybody else felt like this when they dropped their dog off I know it's not just me okay <laughs> anybody else drop has anybody else felt like this comment below comment below if you felt like this comment below if you just want to throw some support our way Let's get off this. Let's cut to a good scene of us picking him up. All right, guys. He's still not himself right now. We just got home and I got him laying down in his favorite spot. Um, man. You see, he's just, he's a little out of it. He's not 100% yet. He'll get better and better the more time goes on. Get all that stuff out your system. Yeah. But the good thing is we got his tooth got his tooth fixed. And everything went okay. I'm not gonna video any more of this. We don't like to see him like that. 
I know you guys don't, and I don't either. Till next time, you guys know who this is. This is Daniel the Big O with the Fluffy Poodle. That's right, Mr. Fluffy Bear and his blue hair. Be okay, buddy. Bye-bye. So we just made it home, and Mr. Fluffy Bear is still feeling drowsy. Um, he's still not his normal self. See his head just tilted right there. He's, we got him laying down in a nice comfortable spot and uh, we'll let him relax. We're, we're not gonna show him like this. Guys, we're not gonna keep showing him like this or anything. Um, I don't like seeing him like this. I know he don't like seeing himself like this and We'll see you guys on the next episode. Till next time, you guys know who this is. This is Daniel the Big O with the Fluffy Poodle. That's right, Mr. Fluffy Bear and his blue hair. Bye-bye.